It's a carriage driver's nightmare. Someone hits them from behind in another vehicle. Both the horse and driver in this case were injured, but as Nine on Your Side reporter Scott Wegener tells us, the driver is glad he took the worst of it. Look, here's blood. Right there's some blood. It wasn't an experience carriage driver Chris Thompson ever wants to go through again. I'm scared to death. Sunday morning, just past midnight, Chris and his equine partner, Midnight Special, were headed home. Midnight was looking forward to a meal of fresh grass. We were starting to go into the fast run. Then a carriage driver's worst nightmare, a driver screeched up behind them. Then he hit us in the back, the carriage jumped to the side. Chris was thrown onto the jagged metal deck of the Roebling Bridge, breaking a finger and gashing his leg and his skull. He staggered to his feet and approached the driver. I'm showing him my finger, I got blood on my shirt, telling him to call 911, I'm hurt. That call was never made. And he pulled around the yellow line and just took right off. Meanwhile, Midnight, also spooked and injured, took off as well, making it only a block from the bridge before being dragged to the ground, tangled up in the reins. He's my buddy, he's my weekend partner. Covington police are looking for the driver who Chris describes as a white male, mid 20s to 30s, with a goatee driving a small blue pickup truck. He better hide well. As for Chris, he's glad he took the brunt of the injuries rather than his beloved horse. You know, if something happens to him, internal bleeding, breaking a leg, we have to put him down. You know? So, me. I ain't getting put down because of broke leg, broke finger. I'll get back up and go. Scott Wagoner, nine on your side, Covington.